when the male uh, confronted the elderly people, he left on foot. Um, our canine um, and emergency response team were contacted and tracked um, the suspect sent to a residence here on Knapp Road. Um, the person or persons um, did not respond to police commands to come out of the residence and therefore the tactical response unit from London was contacted as, along with a crisis negotiator. Um, at 7.15 this morning, uh, the persons inside the residence did exit the residence uh, without incident, no injuries, and the investigation is continuing. This kind of for this area, but it didn't seem all that alarming really, so. Okay. How will now, I mean, you have a, basically a home invasion, an elderly person was attacked in his house and then they, you know, barricaded in a, in a house, is that it, right, right, right next door basically? Yeah, that's, it's alarming for sure. I mean, I don't know what to even think about it. It's, People are getting desperate, I think. Desperate times, desperate measures. You gonna change anything, the way you do anything? You lock your door, like? Well, my doors are always locked, that's for sure. I'm always got a watchful eye. I mean, I don't think there's much I can change, really. Okay, right. you have kids or anything like that? I do have two kids, yes. Okay, does that, uh... Well, you know what, with the school shootings and everything going on, I mean, it always, then you hear something like this, it's it's a little scary. It makes you, makes you wonder what's, what's going on with people, you know, like what's going on with people today.